Allergens! Hey everybody, welcome to Allergy Spike. It tastes good! We're doing gluten free and dairy free. Mm. This is really, really cool. Actually, if you have a crust for your pie that has no egg in it, then you get egg free too. Awesome! But I don't. <laughs> <laughs> so, that idea though. It's also corn free. Yeah. And, um. Sugar free? No, it's not sugar free. Definitely not sugar free. But this. No white sugar? This. Or no brown sugar either. This chocolate caramel pie um, is amazing. Yeah. It is, as long as you like sweet stuff. I do. <laughs> this is amazing. And so it's we start? really, really not that hard. Yes, we'll start. I get some of it. Let's get on with it. Awesome. Okay, so we're going to start off with sweetened condensed coconut milk. Now this is like super cool. I got this one from my uh, health food store. It's 195 milliliters. Um, Let's do organic. Apparently, is the guys that do this. So if that's what you're gonna look for, and okay. I don't know where else you can find it. Yeah. Simple to open. Yeah. Okay. And then you've got mm -hmm. your condensed. So instead of brown sugar, we're gonna use organic coconut sugar. Uh, this stuff doesn't pack like the brown sugar does. Okay. You need one third of a cup of the sh coconut sugar. This will have a little bit of a coconut taste to it, but it's not overwhelming. Yeah. And one third of a cup of coconut oil instead of the butter. And we're using two tablespoons of maple syrup. Okay, that's it. So I turn our burner on. It's a large burner. We're going to do probably about a medium. And bring to a boil? Uh, not quite. What you want to do is you want to get it uh, so that the coconut oil melts in. And as it starts melting, we're going to set a timer for five minutes. And you have to constantly stir it. So that's the one downside about this recipe. You can't leave it on the burner. I have a heavy pot so that uh, it doesn't burn as fast. Okay. And uh, so I'll just keep stirring here for a little bit until all of this melts, is just about melted in. That's a technical term. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you see how there's just a few small pieces here? We're gonna start our timer now. So it's going to be on for five minutes. Looks hot. Oh yeah. So there's about 15 seconds left. So you can see that it's turning into the candy. Caramel. Caramel kind of look. Uh, it and usually takes till you get to about like, I don't know, three minutes left or so. And then it'll start to look And there's like no something. dates in it either. Nope. Okay. So we shut the heat off. I'm going to put my timer on one minute. And I'm just going to stir it with the heat off for one minute. Aggressively. <laughs> well, don't burn yourself. And sometimes the coconut oil does separate a little bit, but don't worry about that. Because it's, it's still really nice. Yeah. Okay, and it's done. We're going to take it over to the pie shell we've got here. Okay, I'm just going to pour it in here. Now, this is the pie shell. Uh, the pie crust that I made in a different video, I'll share the link. Yep. And... We made this one yesterday. Yeah, we made this yesterday, so make sure your pie crust is cool. And it's a really good tasting, gluten-free pie crust. You don't have to convince me. <laughs> I know it is. So I'm just going to move this onto the cooling rack. And now, as you can see, the coconut has separated a tiny bit. Like I said, don't worry about it, it's no big deal. We're going to let this sit for probably three, four, or five hours, something like that. It's got to cool totally. Because if it doesn't, the next step doesn't work very good. <laughs> okay, so we'll see you then. Okay, you can see my water's boiling. I shut it off. I'm going to put my chocolate on top. Um, make sure that your water does not touch the bottom of your bowl when you put it on. And then we'll melt our chocolate that way. So I have two-thirds of a cup of dark Enjoy Life chocolate. It's dairy-free. 
it's an awesome chocolate to use. We're using a dark chocolate because this is already sweet. We don't need sweet on top of it. There is half a tablespoon of coconut oil in here. And that's just so that when you cut the chocolate that it won't break, but that it'll, um, it'll be easier to cut. If you'd rather put one tablespoon of coconut oil in, you can do that. And then um, it'll be even much more of a softer chocolate on top. So right now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna mix this around until this melts. Okay, just by stirring it around, it's melted really well. It doesn't take long at all. And now we're gonna move it over and pour it on the pie. Okay, so make sure you wipe the bottom of your pot because it'll have condensation on it. You don't want that water dripping on your pie. And then just pour it around. It's a happy pie. <laughs> yes, it is. It makes me happy. It takes like a long time to make just because you have to let things set between each, each and cool. session, right? Yes. Yeah. But uh, there you go. And that is done. What we're going to do, uh, you can if you want. If you don't like the nuts, where I usually don't put nuts on it because my dad doesn't like the nuts, but you can put markers on like one for each piece, right? Okay. So then put like 12 of them on. <laughs> I'm just kidding. However big you want to make your, your pieces. So the pieces that have nuts are mine? Since dad doesn't like it? Or the neighbors. We can always give it to the neighbors. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. So you can put it all the way around if you want or however. Decorate it how you want. So now we have to let this go and totally cool before we do anything else. So here we go again and we'll see you in a while. Okay, so it's been sitting on the counter like all day. Yeah. And uh, you put it in the fridge, that will work too. Let's see how do we cut this. I'll start here. I'm happy no matter how big you make my piece. <laughs> I always cut through these tin plates. So the tin plates actually work for one cutting. There you go. Teeny piece. <laughs> well, it depends. If you cut a small one, I'll just take the other half of it. <laughs> See, now you have two pieces. You have this piece and that piece. <laughs> and whose piece is this? Well, that one's not mine. <laughs> okay, there we go. There you go. That looks pretty good. Caramel pie. Hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you next week. Bye! Bye.